Hello guys, this is your boy Ali Silanki and today we'll be talking about the hidden crypto scam that has been plaguing the crypto world for a long time now and people are getting rug pulled because of this. Many people were asking me to make a video on safe moon and here is why I was avoiding it for so long. If you have ever contacted me to develop a safe moon contract clone, you already know what I'm talking about. If you don't know what safe moon is, then it's basically a token developed on the Binance smart chain for which its main selling point is its tokenomics itself. Tokenomics basically defines the economics with respect to the token, like how the transactions will be taking place, the token's total supply, if new tokens can be created or not, and so on. SafeMoon does not have a genuine product at all, nor does it solve any major problem in the crypto market. Anyone can make a SafeMoon clone and it's very easy to do so. In SafeMoon and many of its clones, the main goal is to incentivize the early adopters of the token. So if you were one of the first ones to buy the token, then you would get a lot more than someone who'd invest in later. Which again is completely fine and I don't have a problem with this. The problem starts with the contract code of this token and its clones. Many people just blindly invest in these tokens without understanding or even looking at its contract code. So for all of you guys, after watching this video, no one will be able to pull off such a scam on you ever again. For looking at the contract code of SafeMoon and the likes of it, let's hop onto my laptop and see why I'm saying what I'm saying. So here we are on the official website of SafeMoon, which is safemoon.net. Uh, now, as we go down here we can see the buy now option you can read all about it but here i'll be focusing more on the contract code of safe moon uh, nothing else not even the community nothing else uh, the only thing that i'll be focusing in this video will be the contract code so for the contract code let's just copy the contract address first so this is their contract address uh, as they've stated and if we just go over to bsc scan and search for them actually this is their contract address uh, i've already searched them but let's just search it again and here we are with safe moon and if you go down and see their contract code so the first thing that pops up is the compiler version the compiler version is 0.6 which means it's an outdated version the latest version of solidity is 0.8 so it already has a lot of flaws uh, as you can see, uh, BSC scan is there to tell you all about those flaws. So there are these low severity, medium severity and other solidity compiler bugs already there in the contract code. But this is not what I want to focus on. The main thing that I want to focus on is down on, I think, 760 something line. Uh, let's see. So if you go down this is the safe moon contract okay here is where it all starts and if you go down let's search let's search is excluded from fee okay so this is the particular line 767 that's the line that i was talking about so if you find this line this particular line anywhere else in any of the contracts don't invest in it Okay, and the reason why I'm saying this is because uh, what this line essentially means is that the owner of this contract will be excluded from any fee that is being uh, charged on any transaction. Uh, basically, if you are selling these tokens, you are charged some percentage uh, from them. So some of it directly gets burned, some of it goes into the liquidity pool, some of it uh, goes to somewhere else, whatever it is. Th there are some transaction fees uh, included with it. So when I first saw this line, I was actually pretty confused as to why they have excluded the owner from the fees. Uh, whereas we have never seen someone do this. But um, then I looked more deep into this and this goes way beyond just uh, removing the owner from the fees. What they'll be doing later down the line is they'll change the taxation fees to 100%. What this means is, say for example, you have 100 uh, SafeMoon tokens. Now, 
if you try to sell those 100 safe moon tokens they are worth nothing if the tax is 100% so 100% of your safe moon tokens will be going to the liquidity pool will be going to somewhere else uh, whatever they have uh, kept as the fees wherever they are uh, taking the fees to it'll go there and you are left with nothing so all of those 100 safe moon tokens that you have currently will be worth nothing if they change the fees from uh, whatever they have right now to 100%. And the owner is the only person whose safe moon tokens will be worth something because he can sell it, others can't. So this is the one particular line that makes it a uh, rug pull scam. And I don't know if they have uh, renounced ownership, only after that maybe this uh, token can be um, assumed to be valid. But I don't think they have renounced ownership. So this is a complete scam please do not invest in safe moon or any of the codes wherein you find is excluded from fee owner true don't invest in those kind of contracts so if you're even thinking of cloning this contract this is already a pretty bad contract code uh, it's not good and you should not uh, be cloning this contract please don't co uh, clone it nor use it for your own token nor include this is excluded from fees owner true so this is all from my side and if you still think that there are some other pointers wherein uh, safe moon can be uh, made as a rug pull then do write them in the comment section below i'll be happy to read them all and uh, yeah that's it from my side